Then we're just, we're just feeding it back so that we can produce some volume. Oh, there it is. I didn't know nothing. He was uh, on the row row ship, the roll on roll off ship, which is the ship that brings in the, the vehicles. So it was underneath a uh, Cadillac Escalade. And so the inspectors that got there, they inspected the rest of the vehicle and inspected their surrounding vehicles and didn't find any evidence of any other snakes. It's been ID'd by the, by the Honolulu Zoo as a Western Terrestrial uh, Garter Snake, G-A-R-T-E-R. -E and so it's a fairly common s uh, snake in the Western United States. Um, not real popular in the pet trade, not real popular for uh, exhibition or anything like that, but they are commonly found. And so it's terrestrial, so it's found more inland by uh, rivers, ponds, uh, lakes, that kind of area. A particular species of, of snake is what they call mildly venomous. It's not necessarily venomous to humans, but to its prey, it's venomous. And, it, and it's like a lot of snakes where it starts to break down the muscle tissue. The saliva will break down the muscle tissue of whatever it's eating. And so they, any snake is, is dangerous to white. Naturally, we don't have them here but any snake will come in. We're very susceptible to invasive species. And with this type of snake, its prey is primarily uh, frogs, uh, leeches, and, and fish, and that kind of thing. So it would pose a danger to anything that we had in our lakes or streams.